so hello and welcome back to our channel I'm heading to I'm in the city center like you saw or as you can see if you're just looking at it I'm in the city center and I'm heading to the store I'm actually here to to come and fix my Jeep my Jeep yes my Jeep because I bought this Jeep a year and two months ago and the guarantee that comes with this Jeep don't worry you guys I'm going to show you my Jeep so the guarantee that comes with this Jeep lasts for one year that's the one that comes automatically when you buy it, it comes with one year and um, I decided to take extra insurance for it just in case of in case it's but you know when they market this insurance they will tell you eh, if there's any problem with the Jeep you can come so at some point I had a problem with the tire of the Jeep but let me sit down here and rest I, I'm almost to the place so but I'm just going to sit down here and tell, share a little bit with you guys before I go there so I had a problem with the tire of the Jeep and I complained let me sit down see that's why I like here because you can sit down see all this round round piece pavement that's the places where you can sit down so they know when people walk at some point they get tired so I'm one of those people I'm one of them so I'm sitting down here just to rest a little bit before I continue my journey so anyways as I was saying I was I was talking so I had a problem with the tire of the the Jeep of my Jeep so only for me to go to the store where I bought it to the place where I bought it I went to meet them I told them okay I have a problem with the tire they said okay that I have to go to they now gave me an address of where I have to go to fix it and I have to pay for it and I said sorry I'm paying extra insurance for this thing I'm not talking about the insurance and I said oh, I, I'm not talking about the insurance that comes with it automatically they said yes it doesn't matter and I was asking them okay the insurance that comes with it automatically that one is for one year yes it's for one year um what exactly does it cover does it cover the tire I said no it just covers electrical issue there's if suddenly the jeep stops moving uh -huh, that one the insurance can cover it just for one year and i told them I, I pay extra insurance so what does that extra insurance cover they said it's the same thing it's electrical so why would they make it and funny enough sometime last last year i think sometime last year in i don't know maybe in september last year 2022 i went to this same store and i wanted to cancel my insurance they said no you cannot cancel it until it's one year after purchase that's to say i cannot cancel the extra insurance not even the one that comes with the bike because the one that comes with the jeep sorry it's not a bike excuse me it's my jeep the insurance that automatically comes with this Jeep does not uh, it's not something you apply for it's something it's not something you subscribe to something that comes automatically when you purchase so I said I want to stop the one that I subscribed for I said no it has to be one year after the purchase after the subscription that's only when you can cancel it mm -hmm. I said now wow um, so when I went to meet them that I had issue with the tire they said the, the insurance does not cover it the insurance covers only electrical so i'm wondering insurance covers only electrical issue the extra insurance i'm talking about the one that comes with the with the, with the jeep the insurance covers electrical issue they made me pay for an extra insurance meanwhile the insurance that automatically comes with the jeep comes is only meant for electrical issues like if it stops working every other thing on the body it's none of their business it's just when it stops working that's what the insurance that comes automatically with it covers and they made me pay for an extra insurance that covers the same thing that the that the other insurance the automatic one covers so you see me paying every month for nothing this is very annoying and you want to stop it they tell you you can't stop it it's, it has to be after one year anyway that's the place where i am now that's the that's my situation so he completed one year in January. My dear, I'm still preparing to go and uh, cancel this insurance. So I have not gone to cancel it. I keep saying tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow. 
guess what a year and two months after the car just stopped i said the car the jeep just stopped working you guys want to see my jeep it just stopped working it just went off it just chipped off i had a reasonable very reasonable battery inside and suddenly it stopped working and it was just while i was on my way to go and fix the tire this is the second time I'm, in fact the first time I, they had to change the whole the two tires they had to take it off completely so but the second time when i went to fix it again where i want to go and fix it that was the day it out on the road it just went off just like that in fact i was just like a like what i don't i cannot explain i was just you know giving firing it like pressing it it's not working I, i'm wondering why it's not moving i'm just you know move, trying to move my body only for me to look at the the stuff I saw that it was blackout, like it has gone off. So I tried to press it to turn it on for where. So I just concluded, I said maybe the battery is dead. I said maybe I didn't charge it, but I saw what I what I came out with. I saw the current now. So anyways, I now came to the house. I took the battery and I plugged it. The battery is not even showing. The battery is showing red. The charger is showing red, rather. The charger is showing red. When I plug it, it's still maintaining that red. Normally when you plug it, the charger is green, sorry. No, 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 it's red. It was showing red. So when I plug it, it still maintains that red. It's supposed to show me green when it's charging. But it didn't show me green, maintain that red. That's when I knew that the, this thing has packed up. <coughs> so now I'm taking it back to them. But my question why I'm making this video is, you see these people, they know what they do. They give you a guarantee of 12 months. And after 12 months, don't expect anything good from it again. But you don't know these things. They will not tell you these things. You you buy something. They give you guarantee of 12 months. And just two months after that 12 months, like 14 months after buying it, it trips off. Just imagine. Now I'm going to go and meet them. Of course, my extra insurance is still reading because I didn't stop it yet. But the question I'm asking today is, what if I had stopped that extra insurance? Imagine me paying for one year and two one year and two months and just when I stopped the insurance my my jeep packed up my jeep just packed up like that and it stopped working so now I have to of course when I go back to the shop where I bought it they will tell me the one year that I bought it has passed so the automatic insurance that comes with it is already over so anything they do for me I have to pay so my joy is that thank god I didn't stop this extra insurance that I pay I usually pay every month thank god I didn't stop it because if I had stopped it and just like maybe one week after this thing packed up, it go pay me well, well. So right now I'm just sitting at the city center, enjoying the sun, enjoying the view while um, I talk with you guys. So, but I think now it's time for me to go. <coughs> it's time for me to go and go and fight them. If I don't fight them, let me know what I'm going to go and fight now. I don't take rubbish. I don't like what I hate. I'm going to go and fight now. So, yes, that's what I wanted to share with you guys. You guys want to see my Jeep? Let me show you my Jeep. I can never find a Jeep like that. Look at that beautiful Jeep. Look at that. 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 You see my Jeep. Look at my Jeep lovely jeep so let me quietly take it back to where i bought it you know why i bought it from a store because the last one i bought less than a year after buying it it stopped working and guess where i bought it online if you buy online where will you, where will you start from to to send it back because for you to send it you have to use money to send it where's the office safe girl that's the disadvantage of buying things online. If I learned from that one, that's why this the second time, after that one packed up, I think about six months after, it packed up. So, of course, that one will come with guarantee. Yeah, you won't see them carry and go now. Any shop you go to, they tell you, no, since you bought it, yeah, it has to be online. So, that's how that one packed up. I just went to, quietly went to keep it. Because you didn't buy, I didn't buy it from a particular store online. I just bought it from a random store. It's not like all these known names that you buy it and in the city where you live, you see the shop and you just enter there and go and buy it and go and um, fix it. I just bought it from a random listing on Amazon. 
So anyways, I learned from that lesson. That's why I refused to buy it online again. I decided to go to a shop so that if anything has, if the thing has K leg at any point, I will, I will return it. And now it has, now it has K leg, and it's transferring to bow leg. Before you know it, now the leg will come break. So let me go to the shop before the leg will break. So thank you so much for watching this video. Thank you so much for staying with us. See you in our next video. Bye bye, and don't forget play little.